It's an honor and privilege to once again be named to this prestigious list and to also be in the company of such great advisors across the country. While this is certainly a, an individual recognition that I'm proud of, our team and clients at the center are what mean the most to me. This is truly one of the proudest moments of my career. I've always regarded Forbes as a very prestigious uh, magazine and publication. Uh, it really means a lot to me, my family, and my support staff. The average age of a financial advisor is 55, many of whom are considering retirement in the next five to 10 years. When a client decides to partner with the center and I, they know I'm gonna be by their side for the entirety of their retirement. Believe it or not, I was only 19 years old when I started my first job within a financial planning firm. Fast forward 17 years later, and I'm more in love than ever for the meaningful work that we're able to do for our incredible clients. Well, I think one of the biggest advantages is if you're working with an advisor who's between the ages of 35 and 39, um, they have probably had a decent career by now. They have you know, a fair amount of experience, um, but they're not necessarily looking to retire anytime soon. So if you're nearing retirement or you're in retirement, you should have an advisor for potentially your entire retirement, which I think uh, is a big advantage. I have an expertise and passion for helping clients in the retirement transition. With my designation as a retirement income certified professional, I really focus and, and spend a lot of time with clients to determine how much do they want to spend in retirement and ultimately help them recreate that paycheck when they're no longer working in the most tax efficient way possible. My number one goal is to take stress off the table for clients so they can really focus on the activities that provide them joy, meaning and fulfillment. That's really what I'm passionate about. And if we can achieve that, we've done right by the client. I think one of my biggest assets is strategic thinking. In my early 20s, my mid 20s, I played a lot of competitive tournament chess, went all over the country competing in huge tournaments. And what it did is it uh, made my brain naturally wired to handle complicated positions. I found in my working experience that finance and chess have a lot of parallels. And so I bring that strategic thinking to the table for clients to approach their financial situation, uh, just like I would with a complicated chess puzzle. Also, it, it helps that I have 16 years of work experience and I'm a likable and trustworthy guy.